What's up guys, welcome to another FIFA Ultimate Team video and today EA have released the Summer Heat Weak Foot Boost vote winner which of course was Roberto Firmino, I voted for him myself. He has received a 93 rated centre forward card along with now a 5 star weak foot. We're going to check out his in-game stats then we're going to see how much it costs to complete this SBC before finally talking about the best chem stars to use with this particular player. So let's start off with the work rates, high attack, high defence. It's not great for an attacker. You're really looking for the high attack with either a medium or low defensive work rate. Skill moves of five stars, fantastic. And that weak foot of five stars, very nice to see too. In terms of his pace, very good pace for a centre forward cam with the acceleration of 89 and sprint speed of 88. However, in terms of being a striker, I really do feel that top quality strikers within this game are well into the 90s with pace. In terms of his shooting stats, the attack positioning of 97 is very good along with the finishing of 95. Shot power of 90 is okay. Long shots of 85 are not bad and his volleys of 90 are alright. But penalties of 80, it would have been nice to see them a little bit higher. In terms of his passing stats, vision and short passing are very good at 96 crossing of 81 is okay free kick accuracy of 73 is pretty poor his long pass of 85 is nice and his curve of 90 is pretty good as well in terms of his dribbling stats it's brilliant to see ball control dribbling and composure at 96s and his reactions of 93 is a nice stat too balance of 88 is okay but agility wise at 87 for top class attackers right now could be considered a little bit low with the majority being within the mid to late 90s in terms of his defensive stats he's not too bad here but he's not really his game so we'll skip past those and physically jumping of 89 is good stamina of 97 is very very good strength of 81 is a nice stat along with the aggression of 80 in terms of his traits he contains the flare trait but free cpu traits which mean nothing to us which is a bit disappointing generally speaking this card is a nice card however Based on how the other boosts have worked for other players within the Summer Heat promo, like Ndombele went from an 81 base card to a 93 Summer Heat card. Perisic went from an 84 base card to a 94 Summer Heat card. Jovic, the first winner of the vote, went from an 83 base card to a 93 Summer Heat card. So this Firmino, which was an 86 base card, I was kind of hoping we'll see him as a 96 Summer Heat card, and that just hasn't happened, he's a 93. Also, considering that his last special card was an 89 rated Team of the Week Moments card, again, kind of lends to the disappointment of this only being to a 93 rated card. But like with all SBCs, it's all dependent on how much this particular card costs. Now, it's good to note that he is around forever, essentially, until you decide to complete it or just stop playing the game because then you wouldn't complete it and just requires free squads. The free squads are a Liverpool player in an 85 rated squad with 75 chemistry. You get a prime mixed players pack in return. The next is a Premier League player in an 86 rated squad with 70 chemistry. You get a rare mixed players pack in return. And then finally a team of the season so far or team of the week player with an 86 rated squad, 70 chemistry and you get a premium goal players pack in return. I got a funny feeling this is going to come in very expensive considering the card that you get in return. Um, just looking at it right now, according to Footbin, you're looking at well in excess of 400k to complete this SBC just from liquid coins, which I think is very expensive considering some of the other summer heat cards that come out. I did originally think Jovic was pretty expensive, but compared to this Firmino card, he seems like a, a drop in the ocean con considering... He's got a four-star skill moves and five-star weak foot. It's very surprising to see that EA regard this Roberto Firmino with a five-star skill moves and five-star weak foot so highly. I presume also because he's in the Premier League and is Brazilian as well might have contributed to how much this SBC actually costs. But of, of course, he's around f for ever essentially so that's kind of nice to see now when it comes to chem styles if you do complete the sbc i got a few in mind that i like best for him the first one i'm going to be recommending is a sniper within a plus 10 chemistry positioning in the dribbling category you'll see his agility become a 97 which is fantastic balance becomes a 93 which is very nice his reactions goes up to a 98 and then ball control dribbling and composure all max out to 99s which is very very nice indeed in terms of his shooting stats the positioning, finishing and volleys all max out to 99s and his penalties becomes a 95. Another chem style I would consider using for this card is a marksman. Reason for the marksman is generally now I'm kind of enjoying the physical boost aspect of the marksman 
chem style and also he gets good boost within his dribbling and shooting stats as well. So from a shooting perspective, his positioning and finishing max out to 99s along with volleys. His shot power and long shots both become 95s with his penalties improving to an 85. In terms of his dribbling stats, agility becomes a 92. His balance will stay at an 88, but I think that's generally okay. His reactions become 98 and his ball control and dribbling both max out to 99s, making him very, very nice indeed. And from a physical point of view, jumping becomes a 99, strength becomes an 86 and aggression becomes an 85. Another chem star I consider would be an engine just for the pace boost, especially if you want to play him a bit further up the park as a striker. This could be very handy indeed. So what you'll see here is his pace becoming an, a 93 overall with the acceleration becoming a 94 and sprint speed becoming a 93. From a passing aspect, his vision and short passing will max out to 99s with that long pass becoming a 95, crossing becoming an 86 and free kick actually becoming an 83. And then finally in the dribbling category, his agility becomes a 92, balance and reactions become 98 and ball control and dribbling both becomes 99s. The final chem style I'd recommend for him is a maestro. Generally speaking, his physicals and pace are very nice. And if you're going to play him in that centre forward kind of cam role, this could be one of the best chem stars to use for him. What you'll see from a shooting aspect is his positioning and shot power both max out to 99s, with the long shots and volleys both becoming 95s. In terms of his passing stats, vision and short passing max out to 99s. Free kick actually becomes an 83 and a long passing becomes a 90. And then from a dribbling stats, he gets a nice boost to agility, bringing it to a 92. His balance will remain at 88, but again, like I said, I think that's all right. Reactions become a 98. Ball control and dribbling both max out to 99s, making him a very good cam centre forward. Generally speaking, this card is, for all intents and purposes, very good. It's just a little disappointing that he has quite an extortionate value in order to complete. But at the same time, he's 5-star, five 5-star, five plays for Liverpool, is Brazilian, so he's got loads of link ability there. And with the right chem style, looks like a very impressive player. Would I recommend completing this SBC? If you can complete it for a hell of a lot less than 400k coins, then definitely complete this SBC. I think he's a worthwhile addition to anyone's team. And you've got all the time in the world to complete him because there's no time limit in order to complete this Roberto Firmino card. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. I've hoped you enjoyed it. I hope you find it useful. Please leave your comments below. Let me know what you think of this Roberto Firmino card. Let me know what Kemp stars you're going to put on him. Let me know if you can complete him for less than that 400,000 coin estimate currently on Footbin. And until next time, please remember, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll check you guys out. Laters.